A state lawmaker from Tampa Bay is crafting a constitutional amendment to let voters decide if Greyhound tracks like Derby Lane should be closed once and for all. Our Carson Chambers is live at the track with the debate that's now heating up in Tallahassee. Carson. Right, and that proposed amendment would be in voters' hands if it ever were to make a ballot. It would allow folks to decide whether or not places like Derby Lane should even be open. And one Tampa Greyhound rescue group says that it'll stop a lot of animal cruelty. It's a green tattoo. A faded tattoo inside her right ear. Um, there are either two or three numbers and a letter. 3-2-A means Jazzy was born in March of 2012 and the first of her litter, a racing greyhound retired and now adopted by Don Goldstein. They're in those cages 22, 23 hours a day. They are fed what's called 4-D meat. Um, 4-D is the FDA classification for the meat. It stands for dead, disease, decaying and down. Goldstein runs a local Greyhound Rescue, adopting out Greyhounds from Derby Lane and from tracks across the country. Only 18 tracks are still left in the U.S., 12 of them here in Florida. Greyhounds at Derby Lane tested positive for cocaine in January of 2017. I personally believe that if the Floridians knew what was going on behind the curtain, then in June, a dozen dogs tested positive for cocaine at a Jacksonville track. I don't think people would be supporting this industry. Now Representative Tom Lee of Brandon is pitching a constitutional amendment to phase out Greyhound racing for good in the Sunshine State. It phases it out over three years, third, third, third but it lets them keep the card room. The tracks are already losing money for the state. Card rooms keep them afloat. In 2015, they lost the 12 tracks combined, lost $31.6 million according to the Department of Business and Professional Regulations. But the real reason Goldstein believes these tracks should be through, the way they treat animals like a number. And I actually contacted Derby Lane and the Florida Greyhound Association that lobbies for racing. I even reached out to some of their board members and I got no response from anybody. Live in St. Pete, I'm Carson Chambers, ABC Action News.